Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television GPTV. I'm Brett and my hands is by water. The Felix Man story. It is by Jason Lansdell. Sanka Banarji is the artist. Richard Momsen has handled the script. And the story is about, it's a true story about this person named Felix Manns. Um, and it's a story of friendship. Uh, Felix Mann was kind of a follower of Ulrich Zwingli. Uh, this all takes around, takes place in like the 1500s. Uh, and it's about this kind of movement, uh, the visualization of the birth of the Radical Reformation. Um, and it's a, this movement where they were kind of like rejecting Catholicism and wanted to kind of get back to, I think, the basics of like Jesus's teachings. Like it's not about taxes and tithing. It's not about Lent and, and not eating things. It's not about crosses and statues. Uh, it's about good deeds and sharing food and all that, like the real basic good stuff. Um, I don't know any of this. This is history I'm completely unaware of. And I think that actually kind of works against me a bit, uh, not knowing much at all uh, of the history. Like I kind of walked away with, after reading the story, the base, basics of it. Um, what's good is there is a lot of material afterwards. There's an appendix that goes through historical figures, timeline, um, the actual articles of Peasants' Revolt, uh, about the baptisms, like just a lot of the history that is within that actually explains it deeper. And I think that explanation kind of shows off the weakness of the actual main story uh, itself. And that, like, I, I was able to get the basics of it, but I don't think I got much more depth of it. Like, I, I kind of understood of you know, this, this, that Manns and, and Zwingli was kind of doing good things. And then Zwingli seems to kind of fallen in with the Protestants and, you know, kind of changed one bad for another bad and was sort of falling off of, of what he was spewing initially, which then kind of pissed off Manns who went to did his own thing. And of course that got people angry and then, you know, Manns paid for it. And I think that's kind of the, the general gist of it. Um, and it's, I mean, it's it's interesting, you know, it, it definitely kind of gets you the basics, but really I think it's the, the back material that stands out and made me really kind of understand what was going on. I mean, again, I know nothing about this, so, you know, really coming in blank, you know, I think that kind of ex really sums up where it's at. Um, the art is interesting, it's kind of like this, I don't, I don't even know how to describe it. Um, it's interesting. I think the, the art, it too, kind of falls a little bit short at times. It's hard to tell some characters from each other. Uh, Zwingli and there's another person that I think looks really, really familiar, or really similar to him, I mean. Um, and the, the two of them together, like, it's just, it's not, it doesn't work well. Uh, they're almost too similar to each other, and it kind of gets a little confusing. Um, but overall, like, it, it's interesting. It's, like, broken into ch chapters with mans and... Yeah, I mean, it's just one of those of, like, other other things is, like, it kind of dances around who people are and doesn't go into too much depth of them, and it's, you know, it's it's okay. Like, I think this is, the material overall is good, but it's really because of the back material, not necessarily the comic itself. Um, so, yeah, I mean, again, I don't know much about it. I don't know if there's, you know, other things out there that makes this way easier to, to understand, uh, but, like, I just, I think the, the comic itself wasn't, it didn't, wasn't clear enough. The narrative just wasn't quite there to really explain who everyone was, what's going on, and uh, make things quite as digestible as it could be, or educational as it could be. Uh, but the back, again, back, back material is fantastic and kind of makes up for it. Uh, so you can get this now. It should be in comic shops. I've got a link beneath this video. Put in your zip code. It'll tell the comic shops near you. No shop, no problem. We do have some links where you can purchase your own. There'll be affiliate links. So we're going to get a small percentage by doing that. You'll support our site. So thank you for that. I want to thank Plow for publishing for hooking us up with this review copy. We appreciate that. Of course, thank you all for watching. If you are into comics, if you're into graphic novels, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, Instagram, TikTok, Mastodon, all graphic policy, keeping it nice and consistent. Until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games. 
you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.